I'm Shelly Holt. I teach kindergarten at McCullough Elementary and I've taught for 31 years and they've all been in Republic. My very first year I taught third grade and then I moved to first grade and taught that and then went to kindergarten, looped one year and then went back to kindergarten. Well, I grew up here in Republic and I had a lot of amazing teachers. And when I say amazing, I mean I had amazing elementary teachers that I could name every single one of them. My second grade teacher was Miss Pippin and she probably was the one that inspired the love of learning in me because she was just, she always made you feel important. And I thought, that's what I wanna be when I grow up. I wanna be Miss Pippin. Of course I love watching my students bloom. I have kids that come in and they don't know how to hold a pencil or write their name, but by the end of kindergarten, they're reading and they're writing. And I, I think that's pretty special. However, I think the most important thing is the relationships you build with the kids and the family. Back in 1994, I was teaching first grade. It was my second year of teaching and I had this shy little boy and his name was Peyton Stringer. And then six years ago at kindergarten screening, I saw Peyton and his wife, Megan, with their oldest and her name was Emery. And I was like, how cool would that be to have Peyton's daughter? And I was fortunate enough to get Emery for two years because I looped with her. So I had her for two years. And then the following year, I got their middle child, which is Finley. And then this year, I have Penny. So I've completed all the Stringer kids. And I think that that's pretty, it just melts my heart to know that I was able to teach Peyton and his daughters. 30 years ago in 1994, Daddy was in first grade and had Miss Holt, right? And then Emery had her, you wanna say how many grades you have? I had her in kindergarten and first grade. Finley? I have her in kindergarten. And? I already have her in kindergarten. <laughs> he currently in kindergarten. You know, we uh, as a family have had first-hand experience. Um, uh, when I had Miss Holt, obviously a long time ago, but uh, I remember her being so sweet and caring. And um, she also can be very firm, though, too. <laughs> you know, we had a, I had a couple good friends in my class at the time. We were always kind of rough and rowdy, but she would put us in her place very nicely, though. And uh, so I respect that. And, remember those days. It's been really cool to see the transition of, of each of the girls through their growing up uh, and having her and how they've adapted and uh, how each each individual girl has kind of changed and evolved around what she's taught them. And she's a legend in our house and, and uh, we are so thankful for her and um, for everything she's done and continues to do and um, yeah. Miss Holt is a good teacher because her kindness, her helping, and her patience. She helps us like get back up on our She goes the extra mile um, and it gives the time where the time is needed. And uh, every child that has had an interaction with her knows that she's so sweet and kind and, and cares so much about everybody in the classroom and the, the district as a whole. And, um, so that's why she's so special to us, yeah. I don't think there's very many people that have had a son and then all of their kids. I think that that's pretty special, but that's probably why I'm still here. You know, it's 31 years and I'm still going strong. And I just hope that I made a difference in their life. You know, I don't know if I did, but I hope I did because that was my goal is just to make sure that my kids feel loved. You give a lot, but you get a lot from it. It's, it's probably the most rewarding career one could go in. You never really understand how much a teacher impacts the, the life of an individual until you're out of school and you look back and you have your own kids and you're like, oh my gosh, you know, so many people overlook that, like the little bit of time that, um, you know, these teachers, you know, do have with these children, which is a year, is not that long. You know, they can really change their life forever. And we just want to say thank you um, from our family. And we've been in Republic a long time and uh, we appreciate all of you so much. Thank you, Ms. Holt, um, for everything you've done, not only for our family, but for so many other families. Thank you, Ms. Holt, for being a really nice teacher to all of us and being really kind. Thank you, Miss Hope, for being a loving teacher. Thank you, Miss Hope, for being so nice to me.